What is crack lacking, y'all? It's Game Walkthroughs 22, back with another World of Nintendo review. Today we are finishing the 2.5 inch Wave 6. I happened to get the rest of the Wave 6 2.5 inch figures that I was missing for Christmas. So, yep, here they are. So we have 8 bit Red Link, Blue Yoshi, Boo, and Purple Pikmin. And before we take a look at the figures, let's have a quick look at each figure's packaging. I Yeah, I did manage to save everybody's packaging, so without further ado, let's have a look. So here is 8-Bit um, Red Link's packaging. Looks very nice. I'm not going to go into too much detail. It's pretty basic. Um, yeah, character's name, and there's uh, the back. And yeah, the other figures you can get in this wave. 8-Bit Mario, 8-Bit Luigi, 8-Bit Red Link, Purple Pikmin, Blue Yoshi, Princess Peach, Boo, and Deku Link. And of course these are all made by Jack Specific. And uh, there's Blue Yoshi's packaging. And yes, they are all, uh, again, like Princess Peach and Deku Link, Series 1-6. So, yep. There's the back. Mm -hmm. And whoop, whoops. Sorry about that. Um, here is Boo's box. And finally, here is Purple Pikmin's box. So there's all the boxes for these guys, so let's have a quick look at everybody. So 8-Bit Red Link is just a repaint of the green 8-Bit Link from uh, Wave 5, and then Blue Yoshi is um, a repaint of Yoshi from Wave 4, and then Boo and Purple Pikmin are the ones that are the only really new ones in this wave, even though these these two I would still consider new because we haven't gotten variants of 8-Bit, Link, and uh, Yoshi like this yet, but um... Uh, what can I say about these? Uh, uh, I was very excited to get these to finish off Wave 6, so now the only figures, the only 2.5 inch figures I'm still missing are the Red Pikmin and Cranky Kong. I'm really hoping to get those soon. And also, I would like to get the Walgreens exclusives, which are 8-Bit White Link, 8-Bit Cla Classic Mario, and 8-Bit Star Power Mario, but those are like a pain in the ass to find. So, but hopefully I'll be able to get my hands on those. Um, so, first have a look at 8-Bit Red Link. Um, just like regular 8-bit link there is no articulation just a nice statue if you will just I mean 8-bit link except he's painted red and he looks very nice and I'll just bring in regular 8-bit link just to compare so I mean as you can see they're basically the same they're basically the same figure, except just one is green, one is red. That's really it, so... Yep, and, uh, like... Um... Like the regular 8-bit link, as you can see, this one, nothing interesting going on behind. Just... plain black... background, or, um... Just, um plain black pad on the back nothing really going on so um but he's still a pretty kick-ass figure I still I really love him I love all the 8-bit characters and I can't wait 
I can't wait uh, to get the other 8-bit characters. So we have Blue Yoshi. Ah, for the hell of it, I'll just bring in regular Yoshi just to, uh, eh, just, I guess, a comparison. So you can see one is green, one is blue, one has orange shoes, one has purple shoes. Yeah, other than that, they are basically the same. So, and articulation, I'm not even gonna, oh god, <laughs> I'm not even gonna explain about the paint job or anything, because the yeah, paint job looks pretty good, there are some scuffs, but, um, not that bad. Articulation, just same as the regular Yoshi, head goes 360 degrees all the way around, arm, and then both arms go 360 degrees all around, and that's it. So there is Blue Yoshi. Let's see. All right. And then Boo. Now Boo is... I think Boo is pretty cool. Um, I feel like this Boo is kind of similar to the Connects Boo, which I'm not going to bring in because... I don't know, I just don't feel like... I don't feel like bringing him out, but, um, he's, uh, he's pretty cool, uh, I'm not gonna say he's one of the best two and a half inch figures made, but he still looks pretty cool, um, if I have one complaint about this boo is that, um, Jack Specific forgot to put in the uh, the little white dots in his eyes, so it's kind of creepy without them. I mean, you even probably saw on the back of the like the back of the box the um, the picture of Boo. Like, see, even has the white dots in his eyes. But as you can see right here, if the camera will focus, hopefully you guys can see this. Uh, you might be able to see it, but Boo does not have the white dots in his eyes, even on the back of the package, so, but, um, he, uh, still looks pretty nice. I heard people complaining because he felt like he was cheaply made because he has no weight to him, he's just, like, he's very hollow, but I think, I think, um, Jax did that on purpose because, I mean, he is a ghost, and ghosts are, like, really light, They're, like, light as a feather, so I think they did, I think they intentionally did that, which I can understand because it's more, like, how... Uh, booze would be and he does have two points of articulation his both his arms move it's very very stubby arms and that's it so yeah not much else I can say he is uh, pretty cool okay and then finally purple Pikmin uh, the uh, purple Pikmin uh, he's he looks pretty awesome. I think he's probably my favorite out of out of these four. He looks um very cool. And of course, you can see he's purple and he has the uh the green leaf on his antenna and he has one point of articulation just his head rotates 360 degrees all the way around. Um his head is very loose though, so and he did come with um a little clear base to uh, stand him up so yeah <laughs> pretty cool and I actually have never seen the purple Pikmin before so I'm thinking he is from Pikmin 3 or no 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 my bad sorry no I, I take back what I said I, I know he's from Pikmin 2 because I've seen artwork of the game and um, and I've seen some purple Pikmin plushes on eBay and I think they mentioned that those are from Pikmin 2, so... Never mind, for, forget what I said, I was thinking of something else, sorry about that. Um, so, yeah, that takes care of Wave 6, 2.5 inch, so th those are the rest of the figures. And, uh, ah, what the hell, let's just bring in Deku Link and Princess Peach to show you the complete collection of Wave 6. So there we go, there's everybody. 
looking pretty cool. So as you can see, I do have the entire Wave 6 now. And, uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to like, comment, and most importantly, subscribe. And next time, uh, we are going to be taking a look at the other 4-inch figures from Wave 4. So I will see you guys then. Game Walkthroughs 22, signing out.